Okay, in case you haven't heard, this summer's exhibit at the Ooh. Minnesota Zoo is all about the llamas. And as I just said, I haven't had a chance to get there yet, so I'm so excited that the llama came to me here in the Carol Levin backyard. It's going on until Labor Day, so lots of time to get out there. And we're talking up close and personal with the llamas. We have uh, Zach Nugent here and also Rick Carlson here and also Zorro, right? He is, is the guest of honor oh. this morning. He knows right where to look. Look at beautiful. <laughs> oh, hello, Zorro. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so this exhibit was in the exact same place as the kangaroo exhibit yes. last year, and people love this. They the no do. fences and everything else. It's been so much fun, and we really wanted to keep that exhibit something interactive, where people can go, get close to animals, and llamas have been the perfect addition because they're kind of getting in people's way. Like These this. are social llamas, so you stay on the path, and the llamas are actually on the path. You have to walk around them. And so oh my kangaroos goodness. were wonderful. They kind of, you know. And wallabies, too. And wallabies, too but they kind of kept to themselves. You know, they like their space where these llamas are more, you know, just social. more social. They're more they're friendly. So they are, they're quirky characters, friendly. we and call them. And you mentioned you have a new arrival just last Sunday, so now there's 22? 22, so 20 adults and two babies, which are called Kriyas. And so the Kriyas. latest just born on Sunday, oh, it's so cute. And can the, can the newborn be in the exhibit right away? Already out. So, oh, really? Yep, they walk right away. So we had a couple days where the Kriya and mom just got to bond and get used to each other. And within three, four days already, they were mm. back out with the rest of them. So is this typical of llamas that they are this social? I mean, are they kind of enjoying being with all these folks? They do, yeah, yeah. Well, we do a lot of things with our llamas, a lot of people interaction. 4-H is, is one of the big ones. So so yes, they're very, uh, well, in, and by nature, so, well, llamas are very social animals. Very social so, animals. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So yeah, they, they like the attention. They're, they're, they're kind they're, of they're, up there. I mean, they're face and the eyes I mean they're just absolutely so stunning and you can see here we're looking at the exhibit look at all the kids uh, they just love being there this is a yeah. beautiful how old this is Zorro he's uh, he's 16 16 okay so what's the lifespan they'll live into their 20s okay so he's getting up there and, oh. but yeah he's he's so mellow so he's the are the, are the younger ones a little more spry or is it pretty much like this uh, all the time yeah, that's probably a good statement. The younger ones are a little more playful. A little more spry. spry. Oh, yeah. yeah, they're running around it, having a good time. Is this a typical size? Um, yeah, he's he might be a little bigger than average, um, but but yeah, yeah. He's just so pretty. It's so wonderful. I bet it's been great for the zoo. I mean, there's so many great things at the zoo, but just to have this to be able to walk up to, huh? It's just an extra added element. We have so many great things at the zoo and Llama Trek. It's just that really fun summer exhibit. Oh. Still lots of time to come out. And you know, the llamas are so fun. They're Everyone has their own personality. We have some that are rolling around in sand pits. We have one that likes to stand all fours in a little kiddie pool to cool down. <laughs> one likes to be, we have a big fan. It just stands by the fan with oh. hair blowing in the wind. They're, I was going to say, it's pretty flying. hot for the llamas. I, I noticed you have it shaved here just to probably keep them a little cooler, right? Part of, yeah, part of keep oh, keep my it goodness. Cool. Well, Zaro, thank you for coming to the Carol Evan Backyard. I'll come <laughs> see you and all your friends very soon at the zoo. Thank you both for coming.